Hi, you're watching Farming Discover YouTube channel. Now we are going to show a video on small DIY aquaponics system. Aquaponics is the combination of aquaculture, the raising of edible fish, and hydroponics, growing vegetables and herbs without soil. Basic components. There are many options to add on to these and customize the system, depending on your particular circumstances and goals. For example, most people in cold climates will opt to build their aquaponics system in a greenhouse to keep it going year-round. Tank. A well-tuned aquaponics system can support one pound of fish per gallon of water. When starting out, however, it's better to plan on stocking one fish for every 10 gallons of water to make sure the system doesn't fall out of balance. Most do-it-yourselfers start with either a 55-gallon barrel or a 225-gallon square bin, two standard sizes of food-grade tanks that are fairly easy to come by recycled from the food industry. Bed. Vegetables need some type of water-resistant container to house the soilless medium that they'll be grown in. There are many products available for this purpose, but there are just as many DIY approaches. The simplest route is to build shallow wooden boxes, 6 to 10 inches deep, just like ordinary raised beds for vegetables, and line them with pond liner. Each bed is then filled with an inert growing medium, such as perlite, which is super light, allowing the beds to be elevated off the ground or fine gravel from your local landscape supplier. Pumps and hardware. The miracle of aquaponics is that the plants filter out the waste products from the fish tank, allowing them to thrive without ever adding fresh water, while the nutrients in the wastewater are the perfect fertilizer for most herbs and vegetables. Thus, a pump is needed to circulate the water between the two components and to make the self-sustaining system go round. If you choose to install a solar-powered pump, your aquaponics system will be almost entirely self-sufficient. The fish. Tilapia are by far the most common species used in small-scale aquaculture systems. They are a tropical species, however, and need the water temperature to stay between 70 and 90 degrees to stay healthy and grow quickly. Plants. Some food plants are easier to grow in an aquaponics system than others. Basically, anything that is harvested as a leaf lettuce, kale, arugula, spinach, basil, dill, etc. responds very well to the nutrients found in fish water and can usually be grown without added nutritional supplements. Management and fine tuning. The aerator needs to run 24 into 7 to provide oxygen to the fish. The pump that moves water from the tank to the grow beds should be on a timer that turns it on for short periods of time, several times a day. Thank you for watching, like and share the video with your friends. And if not subscribed our channel, subscribe to Farming Discover.